Yeah, there is some dust in here. I must have forgotten about this package. I bought it in October, I guess. And today we're gonna do the unboxing and my first impressions of this Kodak mini shot. Let's begin. Before I open the box, I want to show you the specification of this Kodak mini shot. So it has 10 megapixel camera with 1.7 inch LCD viewfinder. Then we have photo borders with five filters. Smartphone remote shutter via Bluetooth connectivity. Yeah, uh, you can connect the smartphone to this instant camera. This is the main reason why I choose this camera because you have the option to print the shots you took with your smartphone directly from this uh, photo printer. Then this camera has the four pass printing technology for best photo quality. Yes, this is the second reason why I choose this camera because the photo quality should be really good and the compatible cartridge to this uh, mini shot will be the all-in-one cartridge. Let's see what we have in the box here. Here it is. So here is the camera. So as you can see I choose the white color and the reason why I choose the white color instead of the black because the fingerprints will be less invisible. Here uh, in front we have uh, a small flash. Then on this side we have the micro USB port to charge the battery, a reset button. On the back we'll see we have the 1.7 inch LCD which works as a viewfinder as well because we don't have a physical viewfinder as you can see. What we will see through this is gonna be our shot. The buttons to work with the menu. Here uh, on the bottom we have uh, the compartment to change the cartridges. In the box as well we have a user guide. Now one thing about the instruction manual. I recommend to keep this user guides for uh, one week or two because you never know what issue you can have with the devices that you buy. Uh, anytime you just can go and see what is not working properly. If you throw this from the first day uh, you go online to search for the user guide and in many cases you will not find the online user guide. So in the box as well we have the micro USB cable to charge the battery which will charge in an hour and a half and it will be enough to use all the sheets you have uh, in the camera, around 20 sheets to shot. And as well we have a strap here and this is everything what comes in the box. Okay so let's power this camera on and take a shot. Let's take a look at the menu. As we see, we can do the borderless shots, uh, the shots with the border. Here we have the option to move between uh, different filters like monochrome, sketch, sepia, and so on. Let's leave it to the normal. We can uh, turn on or off the flash, and this is it. So let's try to take a shot. So I did the shot, uh, I can uh, either cancel or print it right now. So let's print and see how is the quality of the photo. So here is the photo printed with this Kodak mini shot. As you see here we have a white border, uh, of course we can cut this, you see, just like that and take it off. And here is the final results. Now the colors are not very accurate but hey, for uh, instant camera this is good enough. 
So as you saw, the Kodak Mini Shot uh, had this four pass printing technology. Uh, there was the yellow, the magenta and the cyan. And the last uh, layer was this uh, laminating layer, which will give uh, the anti-dust and anti-fingerprints to your shot, as you see. So unfortunately I cannot take a selfie shot with this Kodak Mini shot and the reason I can do that is just because this camera doesn't have a selfie mirror. I mean for $100 you don't put a selfie mirror here, this is a big big issue to me. Instead of this let's just go outside and take some shots outdoors. Come with me. Okay, I'm back. So I took a few shots. Uh, the sample of the shots that I took you're gonna see at the end of the video. And now I will tell you the things that I do like and the things that I don't like about this camera. Let's start with the ones that I don't like. Now the first thing I don't like is the fact that it doesn't have a selfie mirror. But I have the solution for that. Uh, you can just uh, take the shot. I'm gonna show it to you. So take the shot, then take a look at the viewfinder, if you are in the frame or if you like yourself. After that you can uh, ocasal or print it. I will print it now for you. Let's see how is my selfie. While it's printing I will tell you what I don't like as well. Uh, I don't like that this camera doesn't have a battery indicator and there is a solution for that too. You can uh, install the app and in the app you're gonna see um, the percentage of the battery that you have in this camera and uh, there is another thing that I don't like is the missing sheet counter yes you cannot see how many sheets you have remained in this uh, Kodak mini shot and this is a bad thing because uh, yes comes with already 20 sheets uh, in the package as a gift or as a starter package but after that, while taking shots, you cannot see uh, how many sheets you still have. So here I am. Now let's talk about things that I do like about this camera. And is the compact design. I mean, has a little bit of weight, um, but design is very compact and very uh, minimalistic, which I really, really prefer. Another thing that I really like about this camera is the price per sheet. Uh, what I mean, um, on Amazon you can find a package for, um, of 20, 30 or 50 sheets for this camera, the all-in-one cartridge, and the price for those will be around 75 cents per sheet, which I think it's a really good one because the other cameras that I know has uh, $1 or even more. So another thing that I really like about this camera is the preview of the shot before you can print it. So through the preview you can decide uh, either you want to print the shot or you don't. With the other cameras you just uh, print and you don't know what is coming out. And the last thing that I do appreciate about this camera is the fact that you have the Bluetooth connectivity with the smartphone and you can print whatever shot you have on your smartphone. Here is the app. Now go to the settings, to your Bluetooth connections. Here we have the Kodak Mini Connect. There. Now as you see it says printer found 40% of battery.
let me in the comments if you do use uh, instant camera if you do uh, tell me which one and if you don't have one tell me which one you would like to buy i'm gonna leave the link uh, in the info box so this is all for my video for today if you did enjoy it you can support me with a thumbs up subscribe to the channel which will be really amazing i have so many ideas so be sure to be subscribed so this is all stay safe ciao